Wind brings highs right around the lower 70s. We're going to see soaking showers through the day along with those strong winds. And it really doesn't get much... Um, it really doesn't change much from there. And this is going to continue even into tonight. So if you have plans for your Friday night, we may start to see some breaks in our skies, but it's not really going to be much to make a difference. So scattered showers will continue tonight and into tomorrow morning. Temperatures will be slightly cooler, but I would anticipate Saturday to still bring some substantial rainfall to our area. We're not looking at impactful conditions. Our winds will finally die down slightly, and our uh, rain chances will also be going down where we won't be dealing with uh, just continuously prolonged rainfall. Tomorrow, though, will be cooler. We're, we're we may not even get out of the 60s. We're talking about scattered showers. And then Sunday does look to be the better day. We'll see more dry time. Still going to be fairly cloudy for us, but just uh, definitely not as damp. And this will be the start of some drier, more pleasant weather into next week. But we're not really seeing much of a break out there today. This is through 4 o'clock, and you can even see as we move through the day, you're going to see several bands of heavy downpours. That's going to reduce that visibility. That's going to make it difficult to be outdoors, driving. Uh, so just, uh, just give yourself extra time. Pack that patience today. We're not only looking at rain, it's also the wind. So when that wind factors in, that's when we have to think of those objects that are loose as well as tree branches, even down power lines. There's lots that are gonna, lots of things that could be uh, playing into those threats today. But you'll notice as we head into Saturday morning, finally getting some breaks out there. But that rain's still going to be uh, stingy. It's going to be sticking around well through your Saturday. You'll see more breaks, but especially for our eastern communities, I do think you're going to be seeing a greater risk of rainfall versus our western communities. And then the system is basically just going to continuously rain itself out to where we will begin seeing drier skies into your Sunday. Still think it's going to be pretty overcast, but winds will start dying down and we will start to see most of that rain let up. And that's only going to continue into your Monday. So looking at that seven day forecast, we will be looking at better conditions, slightly warmer Monday and into Tuesday, and then we'll get a good amount of dry skies. It's not going to just continuously rain. I know this weekend isn't going to be ideal for us, but next week we finally start to see drier skies and our yards are going to be looking more beautiful our trees are going to be greener so even after we get through all of this we will see improvements into next week